Hello, my name is Owen Evans and I'm a member of the support team at Colleague Software. The purpose of this video is to take you through Colleague's SMS feature. The SMS service allows you to send a text message to a candidate or contact from within Colleague. The recipient of the message can then reply which will come through as an email. Alternatively, if you do not want the recipient to reply to the text message, it can appear as though it was sent from the company. You can also control the number of messages sent with the use of credit allocations to the system and user quotas on a weekly or daily basis. Going through the features, you can send a message from either a single record or in batch. Symbols, spaces and text are stripped out of the mobile number field when opening the SMS window. Additional recipients can be added manually or with the use of a distribution list. Your available credits are on display as well as the number of credits you will be using when you send your message. You can enter your message here and view a count of the remaining characters available. And if you would like the candidate or contact to respond, you can tick this box and enter the email address where the replies should be sent to. A standard SMS message where the recipient cannot reply will appear like this. In this example, we have used Demo as the company name. If you have allowed the recipient to reply, it will appear on the phone from a unique number. Should they then respond, the response will come through as an email. The SMS service is provided as an extra module to your system, with the cost of the text messages based on a pay-as-you-go invoicing approach. We'll now go through a short demonstration on how this is used within Colleague. When in a candidate or contact record, you will be able to select the SMS button from the main ribbon. As mentioned, should the data in your mobile number field contain symbols or text, this will be stripped out when the SMS window is opened. You will be able to add additional recipient records by selecting the candidate or contact lookup icons. Enter your message here and choose whether to allow replies. When ready, press Send. You will notice that a history record will be created, marking the date and time of the SMS and its contents. Should you wish to send a batch SMS message, this is done from a search result. Highlight the records you wish to contact and click on the SMS icon. Thanks for watching. For more information on the pricing and the setup of the SMS feature, please contact the support team or your account manager.